Good evening, this is Music Grand Duchess Rasmus Godet. I'm doing this one for the HB Web Smart Webcam brought to you today by Dr. Pepper. Have your Dr. Pepper today. Um, today, it's been one year since I've been doing this. I have to suffer great trauma and great abuse in the army by the army nurse for its members and surrounding supporting members. Uh, so we're going through this process and I'm you know, getting ready to leave them again um, formally, not irresponsibly, as once happened overseas in Korea. <laughs> but today I want to give my personal motivation to, to children and to people who suffer from obstacles in their life, career, loss of family, loss of whatever it is, never become a victim. While I was going through my own trauma with these people who began to label me with so many things, a successful 37-year-old African-American of Jamaican descent. The words became so hateful, so violent, so hostile. I remember in the army being labeled that black, Jamaican, gay, transsexual, whatever it is. I remember suffering from hate and the, 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 the disaffectations of their values because it no longer represented. I am not protected from those values because of who I was. And who I am today, I stand in testament to it. It out whether they want to hear it or not. It is their conscience that is malign. It is men of adversity that carry rank, that were irresponsible and could not suffice to do justice because they would criminate themselves. And because they could not conceive their criminal behaviors, it is easier to kill one, as they told me, one shot, one kill. It is easier to kill me than for them to accept their mistakes. So I give all children tonight. I came to the army up a middle class successful black person wanting to help because of the personification of the values of family, integrity, decency and honor to which I have never found and it has never been personified. I struggle through this alone with the betrayal of family and friends and I will arise from it alone because they themselves were victims of rank and title, not friends of love and family and devotion. Such my earlier childhood relationships has kept me very strong and grounded. Yes, I have one or two family members I do talk to and do initiate contact with for various reasons, not for usury, but in a professional manner. And that's a concern, and that's the basis of all of it. There is no lackluster passion or love or sincere devotion attached to it. For instance, as such, I have idolized, like I idolized the army, the failure you will find in life is the failure of people and institutions. And if you find the success and the confidence in yourself and the success of your character, your personal attributes and abilities, you will never find failure when men has failed you, when men have failed you. Instead, and in spite of their maligned power and their ability to subjugate you to their muscle, you will find the strength and the freedom to breathe and to be happy without them, without their companionship. So do not fall victim to men of adversity. Men at adversity create obstacles for ordinary people to impede them from growth because we are not like them. Get our knee in the black homosexual, gay, transsexual, Jamaican that they all hated. Okay, I will read you this one poem I wrote. I updated one year ago. Here I go. I am Nisa Grand Duchess Rasmus and I stand as God gave me that ability to stand. While homeless, I sat in the rain. Rain fell all around me one year ago, touched my face, kissed my lips, and it fell heavily as I slept under the sky. 
funny thing, I woke up in the morning. Everything was wet. I was dry as a feather. And I give you that testament. This is not a fluke. It shocked me. Where I slept was dry. My face was soft and wet. And every, everything around me, the, the blankets were dry. I was dry. And everything around me was wet with rain. That is a testament of God in my life. And I give you, and I give you that encouragement. You can stand against any Goliath, though they may persecute you. If not on earth, then it will be in heaven. You shall have your justice and your just rewards. So here we go. When the rain comes aborted, it aborted the dryness of my song. It weighs and weighs each, it weighs each tune, it weighs tones to the sweet song of my lonely, lonely beckon. I pay the fee. My eyes feel you, feeling it touch each drop a room on my dry, scaly corpse soft. It soaks me, my tits swell. It floats me clear across its grounded sea. My hair ahead, my nose upheld. The air sets me across the river. A fisherman across the river and grounded sea. A fisherman it endear here envelops me. Awake in grace, the rain it wraps and plays me well. Till then again I sleep in peace. I dream lustfully to the sensual song of Mary, Mary, the wells. The wells the man wraps between my legs. As he swells, I collect his Twitter drops. How the touch of rain and his smell, I forget it not. The tune, the notes, the wiping of the song, so rainy and strong. So rainy and strong. <laughs> so rainy and strong. So rainy and strong. So rainy and strong. So rainy and strong and long. The rain song so strong claims each pain, pain to my ears, to my lover's claims, and wet ways in my pain. He rains and the, the rains wet us in the heated passion and play. This is Visa Grand Duchess Rasmus Kuhn, and I had to give you that little blackout. But here I am. I mean everything I say being of sound mind, body, and thought. It is not a place I didn't want to belong. It is people and place I wanted to belong. But in adversity, when men are unencourageable and indecent, and with your dignity as a human being has suffered, then God comes along, and you stand in that place where you belong, and henceforth your grace and your success, because of success does not depend on belonging to the Freemasons, to any fraternity, or any such institution, but to know the strength of your character, like David and Goliath. Have a good evening.